Hi, my name is James Flint. I'm a professional photographer and I want to talk to you today about choosing an SLR camera. Right. An SLR ca camera is a single lens reflex camera. This means that it's going to be a camera that has the ability or that offers you the ability to remove the lenses and put on different ones. Uh, this is a standard lens that came with this camera. I also have a telephoto lens that gets up to uh, 300 millimeters. And then, you know, there's many other lenses, a uh, macro lens for taking close-up shots, a uh, wide-angle lens for doing interior or some sort of more uh, stylish shots. But again, there's a lot of things to consider when you're choosing an SLR camera. Um, first of all, in saying that you want an SLR camera, you're saying that you're going to want to have more control, um, not just relying on the built-in lens features that a lot of point-and-click cameras have. Um, basically, you're going to be able to do a lot more professional work if you have an SLR camera. Um, and you're not going to be as limited as you would with a, a smaller point-and-click camera. Um, again, some important things to think about are uh, your megapixel size. Uh, depending on what you want to do with the camera, you need to have a certain amount of megapixels. Basically, a general rule of thumb is two megapixels or less. You're only going to be able to use these images uh, in a digital format like uh, an email. Um, you, know, you put them on a social networking account, but they're not really going to create prints. Uh, anything from about two to six megapixels is going to allow you to make prints, but only in like the four by six and five by seven formats. Uh, as you get closer to six, you can get to where you can print some eight by tens. But if you want to do any enlargements, eight by ten, eight by twelve, eleven by fourteens, uh, you're going to need uh, over six megapixels with your SLR camera. So. You know, a few other things to consider, um, some new digital SLR cameras work with older film camera lenses. Uh, it's important to make sure you're not buying a camera that's going to cause you to have to go out and buy all new lenses. So basically you want to think about your megapixels, uh, what type of lenses you already have and what types of, type of lenses you'll be using, and what other plans you have for this camera. And that's how you choose a SLR digital camera.